There is a gloomy shadow of a global recession. Europe is reeling under a cost of living crisis. The US is battling soaring inflation. There are massive job cuts across sectors. The tech industry bubble may be bursting. But the rich and famous have a different worry. The pop and fizz of some expensive bubbly should keep flowing. Richer consumers are literally drinking away to glory. The pandemic may have put a dampener on their spirits, but the connoisseurs of fine taste have a clear liking for champagne. Moet Hennessy, one of the premium champagne brands, is almost out of stock. The French holding multinational corporation is striving hard to keep up with soaring demand. Speaking to Bloomberg, its CEO has dubbed the current period as the Roaring Twenties amid a spending frenzy. And it's not just champagne. Brands like Ferrari, Louis Vuitton, Versace, they're all registering steady sales. These companies which cater to the super-rich have increased their profit forecasts. Others like Rolex, Burberry, Prada and Richemont are all reporting robust sales as consumers unleash their pent-up demand. During economic slowdowns, luxury brands are often insulated. Most of their sales come from the ultra-rich. The super-wealthy are the last to feel the after-effects of any kind of economic slowdown because of the cushion that their extreme wealth gives. This is the classic inflation divide. The rich are splurging as usual, while the poor are pulling back, cutting corners. While the middle class and the poor have to buy the basic necessities to fulfill their needs, the rich continue to buy pricey items. So unlike most global economies, the world's rich are showing no signs of slowing down. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.